Venn diagram. Venn diagrams were introduced in 1880 by John Venn. Venn diagram is an illustration of the relationships between and among sets. A rectangle represents a universal set, and the circle or circles represent a subset or subsets. Example, place the elements of the sets in the proper locations in the given Venn diagram. Given set U and set A, write a rectangle that represents the universal set and a circle inside the rectangle which represents the set A. Then write the element of set A inside the circle and the elements of the universal set which is not in A outside the circle. Another example. Given set U, set A, and set B. Draw a rectangle and two circles inside the rectangle to represent the universal set, set A, and set B respectively. Place the elements of set A inside the circle and the elements of set B inside the circle for set B. Note that sets A and B have no common element. We call these sets disjoint sets. Another example, given set U, set A, and set B, place the elements of these sets in the proper locations in the given Venn diagram. The two circles overlap because there are elements in set A that belong to set B. Place the elements that are common to both sets A and B in the region where the two circles overlap. E, L, O, V. Then outside that overlapping region, place the rest of the elements of set A and set B. Use a Venn diagram to show A intersection B. Shade the region where the two circles overlap. The shaded region represents A intersection B. Use a Venn diagram to show A union B. Shade circle A and circle B. The shaded region represents A union B. Use a Venn diagram to show the complement of A union B. This is simply not A union B. So if this is your A union B, the shaded region represents the complement of A union B. Use a Venn diagram to show the complement of A intersection B. Note that this is our A intersection B. Shade the region excluding A intersection B. The shaded region represents the complement of A intersection B. Use a Venn diagram to show A minus B. The difference of two sets is the set of all elements of A that are not elements of B. The shaded region represents A minus B. How about B minus A? The shaded region represents B minus A. This time let's try three overlapping circles to represent sets A, B, and C. Use a Venn diagram to show A union B union C. The shaded region represents A union B union C. Use a Venn diagram to show A intersection B intersection C. The shaded region represents A intersection B intersection C. Use a Venn diagram to show the union of a and the quantity B intersection C. The shaded region represents A. The shaded region represents B intersection C. Combining both, we have this shaded region. The shaded region represents the union of A and the quantity B intersection C. Use a Venn diagram to show the difference of A and the quantity B intersection C. The shaded region represents A. 
the shaded region represents B intersection C. Subtracting B intersection C, the result is the shaded region represented by the difference between A and the intersection of B and C. Use a Venn diagram to show the union of A and the complement of the quantity B intersection C. The shaded region represents A. The shaded region represents the complement of B intersection C. The result is the shaded region represented by the union of A and the complement of the quantity B intersection C.